Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be teaching you a little bit about how to play the ukulele. So today all you need is a little ukulele. If you can borrow one from your school or maybe you could even just pick one up pretty cheaply from your local like $2 shop or like local Kmart. Usually they're not too expensive, which is great. All right, so without further ado, let's get into the video. So the first thing you need to do when you pick up your beautiful ukulele is you need to make sure that it's in tune. Sounds pretty good and the reason I can tell is because when you strum through each of the strings it should sound like my dog has fleas and that's how you can tell if it's in tune. However, I also over here on my phone have a handy dandy ukulele tuner. So on this app you play your string and it will tell you if you're sharp or flat. So then you're going to need to use this little pick over here and you're going to need to very, very slowly twist it and see if it gets to like a green color. Green color means that it's in tune. So now my, my G string is in tune which means if one of my strings is in tune, it's gonna be a lot easier for me to tune all my other strings because you can kind of hear and you can go, my dog, and you can like tune it from there or you can keep using the app. So I'm gonna keep using the app just very quickly and get my ukulele in tune. All right, so once you've tuned your ukulele, you're all ready to go. So today, the song that we're going to be playing is called Counting Stars, and it only uses four chords. So the first chord you're going to need is C. So that is th your third finger or your ring finger on your third fret. I put down my two other fingers just because it looks neat, but you don't have to. The second chord you're going to need is A minor, which is just your middle finger on the second fret closest to you. Then is F. Now you keep your second finger down and you put your first finger on the first fret on the second string. And the last chord you're gonna need is G. So G is the trickiest and it took me so long to learn, but you're gonna get it, it's gonna be fine, you just need some practice. So G chord, you start with putting your fingers like you're gonna do a C chord, and then you move your fingers up. So your ring finger is moving to the second string from the bottom, the third fret, and your first finger, your pointer is moving to the second string from the back, second fret, and it sounds like this. So C, G, A minor, F. Now the great thing about these four chords is once you learn them and you can transition between them pretty quickly, you can actually play about a million songs. You can literally play so many songs, it's crazy. So then you just have to work on your strumming pattern. But today we're just going to be practicing C, G, A minor, F. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I'm going to be posting ukulele ones all the time, maybe with a different color every day. Who knows? Anyway, I'll see you next time, guys. Peace. Peace out.